Hi guys, welcome to this third video of the Word Pundit Premier League. Uh, as always, we are going to relate cricket with words. That's what we are going to do. Uh, this is Prashant. I'm the founder of Word Pundit and I am making these series of videos to help you learn words through a context that you can relate with. Uh, we've got the match between Bangalore and Sunrisers today. That's what we'll be analyzing in today's video. Uh, an amazing match, right? Just for the uh, twists and turns as IPL does give you a lot of masala. It is a pot boiler, right? So it gives you some masala to explore, some things to explore, some things to think about as well, right? And the first thing that we are going to, the first word we are going to discuss is the obvious one. The capitulation of the Sunrisers Hyderabad from 120 for 2, they were all out for 153. A complete collapse. They bowed in, they caved in, they conceded, they deferred, they relented, they succumbed to the pressure, they surrendered, they surrendered. So when you capitulate, what do you do? You cease to resist an opponent. In this case, the Sunrisers gave in to the, to the Bangalore team right and uh, to the royal challenges uh, they yielded to them and this was mind you this was complete capitulation right so i think the one thing sunrisers did in today's game is they actually it was such a collapse right uh, Delhi Capitals are known for these collapses, right? But uh, Sunrisers today, they kind of overtook them and came up with a collapse of their own, right? So we there were numerous instances. The 4D, 3D player Vijay Shankar was bowled by an absolute peach of a delivery by by Chahel, right? Bestos wicket, big turning points, but that was the start of the collapse. And once that double wicket over came into the picture, the team completely collapsed. It just all, it all, it was like as if all the pins, all the bowling pins, they were ready to collapse. Just one pin falling down and it just led to all of them falling down, right? It had that kind of a ripple effect. So the perfect example for capitulation, it's not a match that they should have lost, right? But they did, right? Uh, an example sentence for the word, the sports minister today capitulated to calls for his resignation, right? So that means he gave in, he yielded. Simple way of learning this word. The second word that we've got today is you're going to learn it through the context of RCB, right? Achilles heel. What has been RCB's biggest Achilles heel? It's not been their batting, it's been their bowling. And when Umesh Yadav today was ripped apart, he just, uh, he did not get admitted into the Dinda school, right, of bowling, which is Bowlers giving 50 plus runs in four overs. So he just about managed to, to avoid that. But I think he's already a member of it based on the performance in the last previous years. Uh, Umesh Adha was taken apart. Dale Stain also went around the park a little for a few of his overs. And you just got a feeling that once again, RCB's fast bowlers are going to let them down as they have been for all these seasons. And they've effectively, the bowling has been the Achilles heel of RCB. Other than Chahal, uh, all the other bowlers have generally struggled. They've let down Virat Kohli and RCB, right? And why is it an Achilles heel? Why is it called an Achilles heel? Uh, an Achilles heel is a small problem or a weakness in a person or a system that can result in total or complete failure. So there's a Greek myth attached to it. Very, very interesting word origin stories. Uh, Achilles was a baby born. This is Greek. Uh, it's an ancient Greek mythology, part of ancient Greek mythology, right? So it's a Greek myth. Uh, Achilles was a baby born and her mother, right? He was a very, very weak baby, very fragile baby. So her mother took her to a river which supposedly had magical powers and made the person invincible and what the mother did was she dipped the baby in that river the water of the river was supposed to make the baby invincible now she held him by the heel she dipped him in reverse she held him by the heel and put him into the water and she took him out of the water now the whole body of achilles was invincible right he got amazing strength right but his heel was not protected and in a war he was targeted 
and he was shot at at the heel and that is what led to his downfall that is what led to his death in the war right that is how he was brought down in the war so this was in the greek myth it's a point of physical weakness which leads to your overall downfall that's been extended to a point of weakness right that results in the failure of a system or a person right so an achilles heel is essentially a weakness something that makes a person vulnerable and imperfection flaw defect failing shortcoming that is what achilles heel is in mathematics as the example sentence quotes has been the achilles heel for a lot of people and as we can see for rcb their bowling has been their achilles heel for a very very long time bowlers giving 50 plus runs or in fact i think in the last few seasons uh, whenever we've tried to support virat kohli just for the passion that he has for the game right and we want rcb to win as well at times uh, we've seen his bowlers making sure that they lose from positions that they should absolutely not right so they get literally they're ripped apart in those final overs and that's been the problem with rcb for a very very long time it's their achilles heel uh, the deep seni seems to be a beacon of hope this season let's see how it goes how it develops right and whether their fast bowlers are finally able to come up with the goods or not right the third word for today is atrocious and why do we have this word today a uh, very very simple reason rcb's fielding was completely off the boil it was at atrocious horrifyingly wicked uh, it just it's something atrocious is terribly 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 bad the number of catches rcb dropped today uh it almost seemed as if they did not want to win at times right a couple of major major chances one dropped by finch one dropped by stain right there was another tough catch at the boundary which was put down uh, some of those chances were tough but if you're going to feel like that there are going to be times when the opposition is going to make you pay so your fielding cannot be atrocious right uh, atrocious is also a word which is used for context where it implies when something is brutal barbaric barbarous brutal savage or vicious right or it is used to imply when something is horrifyingly bad horrifyingly wicked so for example conditions in the prison were atrocious they were very very bad bad beyond the capability of describing it right so that's what atrocious is so whenever a team comes up with that kind of a fielding performance you can remember this word from the context of the match that that is an atrocious effort right uh, these were the three words for today guys uh, i hope you love the story about achilles heel and you're going to remember that you're also going to be able to correlate it with the rcb thank you very much for watching this video this is prashant signing off i hope you had a great time you can always reach out to us on these numbers thank you very much for watching this video and happy learning